Hey guys, today I'm gonna to share with you how to make creamy chicken and mushrooms. And it's made with tender chicken breasts and mushrooms simmered in the most delicious cream sauce. And this is such a simple dish with made with the most minimal ingredients, but it will definitely impress your family. Okay, first things first, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please do so. It will definitely help me out. And also if you wanna to continue to see my simple and delicious recipes. Okay, so to get started, I have a little bit over a pound and a half of boneless, skinless chicken breasts. And what I always like to do with my chicken breasts is I like to, slice them in half horizontally. So you just take your breast and your knife and slide your knife through. And it really helps if your knife is nice and sharp. See, just like so. And then I'm gonna do the same to the other two. All right, so I'm just gonna place it um, all over the cutting board here. And then I'm gonna grab my parchment paper. You could also use saran wrap. And then this will prevent the juices, the chicken juices from flying everywhere. And then you just wanna pound evenly. And voila, you now have chicken cutlets. See how thin it is? And the pounding does two things. It tenderizes the chicken and it ensures that the chicken is gonna cook up a lot faster and evenly. So this will help on your cooking time. And I'm just gonna give everything a good seasoning of some salt and pepper. What I really love about this dish is it's so simple enough to make for a weeknight meal, but fancy enough if you wanna impress guests. And I'm just gonna go ahead and quickly season up the other side. All right, so now the chicken is nice and seasoned, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a light dusting of some flour. And the flour is just gonna give it a nice coating, it's gonna lock in those juices, and it's gonna give it some nice texture. I remember creamy chicken and mushrooms was one of the first dishes that I ever made, and once I tried the cream sauce, I was like, whoever invented cream sauce is a godsend because it is heavenly. The sauce is so delicious. I can't wait for you guys to try it out. All right, so this is the last piece of chicken. I'm gonna go ahead and get going on the mushrooms. All right, so here I have eight ounces of mushrooms that I'm going to slice up. Um, I love mushrooms, my husband loves mushrooms, my, but my kids don't. So I'm just gonna stick with eight ounces of mushrooms, but feel free to add more if you love mushrooms. You could even just double it up. You can add a pound of mushrooms if you like. I love it because it gives it some meaty texture and mushrooms are good for you. Some ideas to serve this up with is rice. That's usually our go-to. We love chicken and rice. Um, you could also do mashed potatoes. I've done this with mashed potatoes and it's really delicious with the cream sauce. You could do crusty bread. So any carb will do, anything that will soak in the sauce. You can make, um, you could do a side of veggies. I'm probably gonna do a side of broccoli, steamed broccoli today. But you could do green beans, Brussels sprouts, spinach. You could throw in the spinach in there if you want. But anyways, I'm done slicing up the mushrooms. I'm going to grab the rest of the ingredients for our recipe. So the other ingredients that we're going to be needing today is really not a lot. I told you I'm gonna keep it very minimal and basic today. So we are going to be needing some minced garlic. I have a half a diced onion here. I have a cup of chicken broth and a cup of heavy cream. And like I said, I'm keeping the sauce very basic. You could add white wine if you like, give it some more flavor. Um, you could add lemon juice. Sometimes I'll add lemon juice to cream sauces and it's so delicious, but today I'm keeping it basic. So those are some options for you. Anyways, I'm really excited to show you guys this recipe. Let's head over to the stove. All right, so I have my pan heated over medium high heat. I'm going to add some oil and I'm going to sear the chicken. I might have to do this in batches. We'll see. All right, so I think we're able to fit all of these guys. <laughs> but like I said, you may have to cook these in batches. So I'm gonna cook it until it's completely cooked through. This will take about, I wanna say three minutes per side. Three to four minutes. All right, so it's been cooking for about four minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and flip these guys over. See that golden brown color? 
That's what we're looking for. So I'll let these guys hang out for another four minutes. So it's been about three minutes and I'm gonna go ahead and remove the thinner pieces. The thicker pieces, you wanna just make sure they are cooked through, so give them a little bit of time. These ones are done. All right, so now that the chicken is all through cooking, I'm going to remove them, set them aside, and then add in our veggies. So in goes the mushrooms, in goes the diced onions, and in goes the garlic. I'm also going to reduce the heat to medium. And I want these veggies to get nice and softened. So this will take about five minutes. I'm going to actually add just a little bit of chicken broth to release those brown bits from the bottom of the pan. There we go. I'm gonna go ahead and scrape those away. And that's gonna give everything flavor. I'm also going to give everything a good seasoning of some salt and pepper. Always make sure to season along the way when you're cooking. All right, so our veggies are looking good. They're nice and softened. Now it is time to add in the chicken broth as well as the heavy cream. And look at this sauce. It's just so heavenly, like I mentioned earlier. I remember when I first started out my cooking channel, I had a friend tell me that a lot of my recipes were creamy. The first time I had made a cream sauce, I fell in love with it and I started to make lots of recipes that included cream. But anyways, um, you wanna go ahead and season your sauce with salt and pepper. And I'm gonna let this come to a boil. Oh, and I also forgot to mention, if you do love lemon, um, at this point, you wanna add about three tablespoons of lemon juice, that should do the trick, and that will make a delicious lemon cream sauce. All right, at this point, I want to give the sauce a taste to see if I need any additional seasonings. Mmm, it's like the perfect mushroom cream sauce without using like any of that condensed cream of chicken soup. It's just mushrooms and cream and some garlic and onions, and it really makes a delicious sauce. So it is time to add in our chicken. I'm just gonna nestle it in here. All right, just let the chicken kind of get warmed through. And this is ready to serve. I can't wait to do the taste test. And there you have it, you guys. Creamy chicken and mushrooms. This is a restaurant quality meal with very minimal ingredients. All right, you guys, it is time for the taste test and I'm just really excited for this one. Got my chicken here. Pour a good amount of that delicious cream sauce on top. Look, you guys, so yummy. All right, let's give it a try. All right, so I've got the chicken, some of the mushrooms, some of the cream sauce. Cheers, you guys. No rubber chicken breast over here. The pounding it made it nice and tender. It's juicy. Oh my gosh, this is so delicious. The mushrooms, the sauce. Make this for your family, make this for your guests. They'll definitely be impressed. Thank you guys for spending time with me in my kitchen. And if you like this recipe, go ahead and click on the like and subscribe button and I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care. Mm.